Good evening. I hereby declare this fireside meeting to be in session. First order of business? It's true. Our civil corps and builders were able to disperse the Eaglers in a surprise operation. In the process, the Show Nash Canyon Bridge was destroyed. All parties involved performed bravely up against great odds, and ultimately their actions led to the safety of Sand Rock amidst the very real threat of invasion from the Eaglers. The most difficult days are behind us, but our job is not done. Before more water can be shipped to us from Portia and Atara, we need to rebuild the railway bridge. Pronto! I have asked Heidi to head this enormous effort. It'll be a difficult undertaking for her and her team. City Hall doesn't have enough budget or stores to ensure a speedy completion. We have reached out to the Alliance for help, but we cannot entrust our future to handouts. And so, I ask my fellow Sand Rockers to help in any way you can, be it construction materials or money. I've already directed the church to give as much as we could. I'm to provide materials. Yes. I reckon we can all do our part in expediting this process. Why, it makes me pleased as pie to see such a unified sand rock as we face an adversity of this magnitude. Well, ain't nothing more to do but to do it to it. Meeting adjourned. Conserve water. How's the workshop these days? Uh-huh. <laughs> Great! Say, have you noticed that a lot more tourists have been around lately? And yet, hardly any of them stopping to buy the stairs! Hard to believe, I know! What could I possibly do to remedy such a situation? Ah, uh, I know! How about a big billboard right there on the train platform? That way, the second they step off the train... Yes, they'll see it straight away! You'll think, wow, by the stairs. Such a nondescript shop name means they don't care about being popular. They must have great stuff. Hmm? Still have doubts? Well, this idea of mine has only been existing for 30 seconds or so. I still have some details to hire out. Given time, well, the sky's the limit, I suppose. You have a keen eye. What image would you put on the billboard? What's something that would really grab everyone's attention? Hmm, well, the thing is, the directions to my shop are in the name, by the stairs. I feel we'd just be wasting valuable ad space. I've got it. Nothing grabs attention in an ad like a friendly face. And being that I am the sole provider by the stairs, limited liability storefront, whose friendly face could it be other than me? Uh, mine. Yes, our discussion has been rather enlightening, I must say. Tonight, I should outline the chart for design for a billboard. Once it's done... Wonderful! I'll get the design to you as soon as possible. Make sure you remember to check your mailbox. Thanks again for your insightful advice.
a better night than I did. <laughs> I'm about to crash. After the meeting with Matilda, I went straight home and pulled an all-nighter working on ideas for the new bridge. But it was worth it. I've got designs right here to prove it. This is going to be a huge undertaking. Who knows how long it's going to take. But the only way we're going to make it happen is if everyone gives it their all. So, I need you to construct the bridge's load-bearing trusses for me. You know, the upper frame structure? We'll need two of this design to stretch across the canyon. Here's the diagram. My team will be working with me, Anne, as we build the base of the bridge. In the meantime, try to get that frame done. I know I said this was going to take a while, but we've been consulting experts on how to speed up the process, so I want that frame finished even before we're ready to install it. If you do finish before us, check out the commission board. I'll be posting all sorts of bridge-related commissions, and every little bit helps. In any case, I'll be curious to check out the frame once you built it. Come show me when you're done. Okay, that's all I got for now. Good night, we can do this.
Must be the builder. Allow me to extend a warm welcome to Sandrock on behalf of Pablo's parlor. I'm Pablo, the head stylist. Pleased to make your acquaintance. I've been staying at Walnut Groove. I didn't know we were getting two new builders. Looks like you two are getting along swimmingly. But, if I may say so, it also kind of looks like you've been swimming in sand and dust. That's where I come in. Whenever you want to change your style, get a new do, stop into my shop and I'll get that dust off and make sure you stand out in a crowd. Ah, you must be here to pick up the completed version of RVO's very modest and not at all narcissistic design for a billboard. My fee is 500 goals. Huh, just like that? No haggling, no offers of exposure. Ooh, that Avio has really done a number on you, hasn't he? You just be careful, you know. He's not exactly known for paying his debts in a timely manner. But that's not really my problem now, is it? Thank you. And make sure you color inside the lines. Thank you. However, it has come to my attention that I ought not be wasting your time like this. I misunderstood what a builder is meant to do. Well, you don't need to worry. I've spoken with Venti of Eufala Salvage. She was quite enthused to assist me in gathering clay from now on. <sighs> well, it was my mistake. 
only builder I ever knew left Bonarok before even getting their license. But, in any case, I'm relieved you've not taken any offense. Thank you. Till we meet again.
Hey, Builder, I got a real important official Civil Corps commission for you. Uh, if you got the time for it. Well, if you're standing here talking to me, that means you must have time. <laughs> Basically, all I need is an official Civil Corps deputy cap for the upcoming promotion ceremony I'm organizing. Oh, and you should join the ceremony too. Being all that's transpired recently, it seemed only right to make you builders honorary members of the Civil Corps. Which means, you may very well be making your own deputy cap. That's right, the next deputy of Sand Rock might even be you. Hey, don't look so surprised, partner. Even new members of the Corps can be considered for the position, and you really showed that Giggler boss guy who's... boss. Anyway, I just wanted to commission a deputy cap for the ceremony. Whoever gets promoted gets the cap. So, what do you say? All right, hats off to you, partner. Uh, let's not get too far ahead of ourselves. Here's a recipe for making it at your work table. Come drop it off when it's made. Now that's what I call a deputy hat. You can really feel the authority flowing out of it. And you know what? I think with such fine handiwork, 
I have just improved your chances of becoming our next deputy. Ceremony is tomorrow in Marl Square at 9 a.m. sharp. Don't be late.